Hawaii Volcano Eruption Update, Fisher 8 Crusts Over, Could Kilauea Erupt Again? Hawaii's Kilauea Volcano erupted explosively more than three months ago and Fisher 8 has been gushing plumes of smoke again during the past week. Could Kilauea Erupt Again? The lull in eruptive activity at Hawaii's Kilauea Volcano continues but it seems there is no sign of Kilauea slowing down. The Hawaii volcano on Big Island sparked more than 20 fissures to break through the ground, spurting lava and smoke when the Kilauea erupted back in May. Now a small, crusted over pond of lava has formed deep inside Fisher 8 where there are a few scattered ocean entries, suggesting volcanic activity is not quite over. However, there is no lava flowing in the lower east rift zone, LARZ, and the flows have not expanded since August 9. No summit collapse events have occurred since August 2 and the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory reports that eruptive activity remains at reduced levels at Kilauea summit and the lefts. Could Kilauea erupt again? The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory status report issued Thursday, August 16 by the U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, says, it is too soon to tell if this change represents a temporary lull or the end of the LERS eruption and or summit collapse activity. At the moment, the sulfur dioxide emission rates at both the Kilauea summit and LERS are drastically lower than have been recorded in previous weeks. The combined rate is, in fact, lower than at any time since late 2007, according to the USGS report. In the report, the USGS said, in 1955, similar pauses of 5 and 16 days occurred during an 88-day-long LERS eruption. During the Mauna Alu eruption, 1969-1974, a 3.5-month pause occurred in late 1971. But this does not show any indication either way as to whether the volcano could explode again. A stream of frequent eruptions and earthquakes have hit Hawaii's Big Island since the beginning of May and three months later, Kilauea is still erupting. The Hawaii volcano has been active since 1983, with more than 60 USGC recorded eruptions. Kilauea is one of the most active volcanoes in the world and has been in a period of heightened activity this year. Due to light trade winds, some areas may experience elevated levels of sulfur dioxide (SO2) gas. Reduce your exposure by staying inside with doors and windows shut or by leaving the area. Do not access the flow field due to extreme hazard. Unstable surfaces can collapse under weight, resulting in injury. Motorists on Highway 11 between the 28 and 32 mile markers are advised to stay on the pavement, be alert for changes in road conditions, and drive with caution. The plates on Highway 130 are stable. Motorists are reminded to slow down while traveling through the area. The Disaster Recovery Center, located at the Pihoa Community Center is open Monday through Saturday at 8 a.m.